Hi, my beautiful Gemini. Welcome to my channel. My name is Natasha, goddess of life, 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely, beautiful Gemini. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. Universal energy, my ancestor, my spirit guide, the pure white light, Archangel Michael. Ascended Masters, please give my lovely, beautiful Gemini a clear, precise, honest message. Thank you. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonate and leave the rest. This is a general love reading for my beautiful Gemini. Energies are fluid. If this reading is not for you, it's not meant for you. Thank you guys so much. I love you guys. Please join me in Patreon. Um, I'm going to post, uh, start posting healings. It's only $5 to join to be a member. So if you guys would like to join me, uh, then the... Uh, Everything is in the des description box below, so please join me and Patreon for more um, healings, guidance. Thank you so much. I'm sending lots of love, light, and prosperity your way. Okay, Gemini, let's get to it. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. Universal energy, my ancestor, my spirit guide, the pure white light. I can draw Michael, Ascended Masters. Please give my lovely, beautiful Gemini a clear, precise, honest message. Thank you, thank you. Okay, that was so much. I apologize. Let's get to it for my jam. I love you guys so much. And you have Seven of Cups. You have a decision to make. Oh, you have a decision to make regarding us of you. Um... You guys could be need to make a decision whether to transform the situation or to release it. That's what I'm here. Um, take the lead. Whomever you are dealing with, you could be dealing with, you know, um, an emperor, Aries, um, Aries or Taurus here. Sacral chakra. So, okay. So, whomever you are dealing with, they come as, as an emperor. Someone is like very, um, someone in here could have in very attracted to you sexually. Or, you know, this is about sexuality here. Someone in here could be, you know, very, very, um, no beginning here. There is a Capricorn. Feeling alone. Okay. So, you could feel left out in the cold. But you are trying to, uh, you know, get a new beginning here. That's what I'm feeling for you. You could be dealing with someone that's very sexual active, someone that's very creative, someone that, you know, um, when it's come to their sexual energy and stuff like that, someone in here could be in the peak of that um, energy also. But it's someone that's lots of creativity in here. And also sexuality, there could be also be um, someone just enjoy sex. Let me, oh Lord Jesus, how about that? We just let that out, huh? <laughs> but I feel like someone felt left out in the cold. Yeah, someone felt abandoned. There was an ending. They feel sad and they're looking at their home. It's like, you know, where's the comfort in that? It's empty. There's a brand new beginning of finance. Someone in here started a brand new beginning of finance. It's about finance. This whatever this is and stuff like that for someone. If it's you, it's finance. If it's this person you are dealing with, it's all about finance. That's what I'm feeling here. This brand new, see? And we cried it love at the bottom. Forgiving and learning. So there was a lesson. I feel like my Gemini, whatever this is for you, this is supposed to be. A lesson so which means that you could be dealing with the comic soulmate that's supposed to teach you something or you teach you teach that person something keep an open mind yeah they're asking you this could be the one someone felt like you could be the one or you felt like this person could be the one mm -hmm. very soon passion 
yeah you guys both have very you know a lot of um passion it could be even like i say a relation that a relationship that based on sex a lot of people um especially if you're dealing with like a uh, water sign these people in love with physical so you know what i'm saying they could be someone in here could be this relationship and stuff like that there's a lot of sex going on a lot of passion but no beginning and stuff like that finance but there's a lot of a lot of passion you know between you two because at the bottom unrequited so we know what happened when unrequited love pop up in a relationship there is not um could be the one or not and stuff like that there's always trouble in paradise that's what i'm feeling here because of unrequited love and stuff like that it's supposed to be like okay it's like comic soulmate one person supposed to come in and teach the other person a lesson and then you know move on i know it's not easy because like i said people fall in love with you know physical you know whatever if it's you know how someone looks what someone do for them and stuff like that the only thing is that it's not going to stop until someone someone do things and stuff like that to waking the other person up listen i'm not supposed to be there i'm only here to teach you a lesson whether it's to stop for you to stop lying whether it's for you to stop cheating whether it's for you to to become a better version of it whether it's for you for money whatever this is and stuff like that, there's a lesson for you guys you see three of cups is at the bottom and also the night of emotion someone in here is very flighty someone in here also could be like third party someone in here could be in a third party and things like that the three of cups and the night of emotions and stuff like that someone like the sexual cards is here so we know someone in here is they like to have be with other people news of emotions i don't know who you're dealing with but okay you know someone's yeah eight of emotions news of emotion this is about love passion you know a lot of lots of creative lots of passion that's what i'm saying someone in here could be like you know let me tell you those relationships until you left you feel this want to leave you feel disgusted about yourself unless you are narcissistic and stuff like that who does i'm not saying you are you know gemini or this person i'm saying you know those type of people doesn't think after they do things but if you are with someone with just passion when you leave that person you're like oh my god are you serious that's all it was you know muse of voice there was communication and you realize that okay yeah we have you know good and then you realize that wow you know the one thing you want from this person you don't have it and it's it's really sucks because someone in here is walking away they want uh, wish fulfillment they want to feel they want to be happy someone in here want to leave you know the eight of cups they want to leave it behind because they're not satisfied the empress someone could see you as the empress the night of materials someone could you know very grounded stable financially stable and but at the same time there was someone in here if it's you gemini you don't want i don't feel like you want to be um you know settle down i don't feel i feel like you you might be flighty here <laughs> i'm being honest you might be flighty here because this person is walking away because they want you know, wish fulfillment you on the other hand you know you could be in a committed relationship with someone you're like that's not what i want because this is you as the empress you want to be free you like to free willy you know you freestyle yourself with different people there's nothing wrong with that two of inspiration yes you are you are ready to make a decision here you're waiting to make a decision to move forwards into you know whatever you want to do because the three of cups in the night of his inspiration here and then the star so yeah i don't feel like you really you know i don't feel like you really want to be you know settle down and stuff like that you know hey the empress gotta do things too when they're not in the element and stuff clarify the news of emotions and this you know this person you see you as a mother you could be pregnant here too mm -hmm. knight of pentacles yeah, because this person want they want a commitment it might be slow coming gemini but it's coming they've had the knight of pentacles yeah knight of swords you get in communication this is you two knights here knight of swords clarify the knight of pentacles commit communication is coming we're getting uh you know seven of pentacles 
yeah someone is is waiting for communication uh you know from you about this um this decision here for a commitment ace of pentacles someone want a brand new beginning in finance that's so i feel like some yeah i feel like this is all about you know money and stuff like like i say the sexual cards give me the vibe someone here is about money it's a pentacle so when you're beginning that's it's yeah see what i'm saying they want to take a leap of faith but they're not sure so whomever you are dealing with this person is not sure they're very undecided because what they want is a brand new beginning in money. Leap of faith. Oh, they are getting out of the head or you are getting out of your head. I feel like you also, your drive, you could be uh, walking away because you prefer to be in a relationship where you can be free. It's about finance, but you also have your freedom. You're getting out of your head with this. You're not going to stay in your head about this, thinking about this person. Yeah, because you're just waiting on communication. Once you get the communication, you're walking away just so you can be, you can, um, you lack your freedom here. Whatever this means for you. Yeah, five of pentacles. Because you could have felt like, you know, you get communication. You get some type of communication here that left you, that, uh, make you left uh, feel left out in the cold five of pentacles please yeah king of pentacles you could be dealing with a, a king of pentacles you know Taurus Virgo capricorn this is someone that's grounded that ready for commitment they will give you that commitment let's see why clarify the king of pentacles please clarify the king of pentacles eight of cups yeah, this person wants to come talk to you. Yeah, that's someone that's ready for commitment. That's someone that's, you know, ready for marriage and marriage material. They're ready, they're grounded, they're stable and stuff like that. But I feel like for you and stuff like that, you will take this offer. You will take this offer because it's giving you some type of freedom here. But because you undecided when it's come to this person. Because you get, you, you're you not sticking in your head. You're not stop, you know, getting in your head. I've seen you getting communication from whomever this is person here, this toe is Virgo Capricorn, you are gone. Yeah. Knight of Pentacles here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You like your freedom. See, this is unstable. You feel unstable wherever you are, wherever you are. If you're currently in a relationship, you feel unstable. You're not feeling grounded and stuff like that. You know, you want that commitment here. Yeah, you want that commitment. You know, the Knight of Pentacles is about freedom. You know, feeling free. I don't want to be, you know, but this is you here. You're like, I'll take that one because it's going to bring me financial financial abundance. Whew, okay. Whomever this is, let's clarify the Empress. Clarify the Empress for my Gemini, please. Clarify the Empress. Six of Swords walking away this is slowly but surely someone is walking away leaving all the mental conflict you no know, the drama whatever this is someone is four swords see what i'm saying this is i feel like this is you so whomever you are dealing with that's what they try to do here four swords leaving the drama behind the healings and eight of wands communications what is this communication? Fast communication is about moving forwards into bigger and better things, leaving what does not serving you, you know, leaving what does not serving you, like partnering with people. But I feel like you're just taking yourself and leave and be doing what you need to do for yourself. Because I feel like this is all about you. You're like, I don't care what you're feeling, don't matter to me. <laughs> this is all about me. That's what I'm feeling here. See? The wall. You feel like this is, you know, someone has unfinished business because the walls and the reverse and stuff. This is unfinished. The Empress. Yeah, the Empress twice. So someone in here could be dealing with an Empress or someone in here could be feeling like, you know, there's someone in here that's single that an Empress they have unfinished business with. 
the cycle is not come is not um over yet clarify the empress please and someone in here could be stalking this empress <clears throat> yeah three of swords excuse me because someone in here feel like this empress is heartbroken yeah see what i'm saying someone you could be dealing with there could be someone in the mix here that feel like this empress is heartbroken because i don't feel like this is you um that's um heartbroken here clarify the two of the inspiration for my gemini let's clarify the three of swords to see clarify the three of swords two of pentacles so someone could, could have juggling you why am i speaking so fast someone could have juggling you and someone else here but let's see because it's with the three of swords that's cause that's what causing the the uh hard work the the <clears throat> the two of pentacles so let's see what's the two of pentacles yeah someone could have been juggling you both but someone in here get the justice though even if it's you Whatever this is, someone get the justice. So someone could be juggling you in an empress. Because you are also an empress. So uh, mm, who are you dealing with? Someone got that kind of power. Huh? There's, I feel like because of someone was juggling and they could be dealing with the Libra. Someone could, but it's, I don't feel like, you know, someone could be dealing with the Libra and Taurus Virgo Capricorn. But I feel like they were juggling. And then the empress get heartbroken and someone get their justice. Let's have the two of inspiration. <clears throat> Four of wands. Yeah, someone could be married or in a stable, committed relationship here. Four of wands, please. Let's have the Four of wands. The hangman, you know, someone is waiting on this. Someone is waiting for this um, committed um, twin flame relationship here. The magician. Yeah, someone is literally, I like this because that's what, um, to me, when I'm looking at, you know, certain, you know, cards give you the vibe of the uh, hangman also while hanging is also manifesting what he wants. Because, the you know, when you're praying and meditating, it's depending on what kind of prayer and meditation you are doing, you're also ma manifesting. So that's what I feel like. The hangman is doing manifesting, but with reinforcement, with a lot of power, a lot of energy, manifesting some, uh, manifesting this stable uh, for once here. Someone could be manifesting a twin flame or soulmate here. They want judgment, but there's some type of conflict. Someone afraid of arguing, but arguing and fight if it's you. Uh, you know, or this person, whomever that's feeling this and stuff, like someone doesn't want to fight. There could be, you know, conflict between this new beginning they are manifesting. And you could be dealing with a Scorpio here. Because Gemini, I feel, I feel this is you that might try to manifest in this new beginning here. But it's going to bring you these conflicts. Ooh. Yeah, whatever you are manifesting. So what they say, be careful what you wish for. You might get it, but it's not going to come easy. Because yeah, there's gonna be conflicts. Whatever, whatever that stability you are manifesting and stuff like that. If you don't want, if you are walking away from this King of Pentacles to be in this relationship here and stuff, it's gonna bring you with some type of conflicts. It's gonna be some fight and arguments. Not going to be easy. Clarify the five of ones before I close out these readings, please. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be arguing regarding working together. You guys want to partner and working together, put on the effort, but there's going to... See, I was going to say that. There's going to be some tower. There's going to be a tower moment. I know. I knew it. I can feel it. I was trying... I've been avoiding that to say it for a while and stuff like that. Because some of one, you know, you see, the Hierophant and the Knight of Cups... And someone is going to try to slowly but surely, you know, try to be stalking someone, watching someone, do all type of things to offer someone else love here. Because I feel like this, this is a little bit complicated, but I know, like, I saw this, the five of ones, I know over here there's some tower moment that's coming because someone in here is not being truthful when it's come to what they want here. 
you manifesting someone something and stuff like that that's what they say i'm um, put it in there be careful what you wish for you're gonna get it but it's gonna be a temporary victory here be careful see what they say here gemini to have compassion or you or this person someone need to have compassion for the other Yeah, forgiveness and understanding. Yeah, the eight of pentacles here is about understanding, about, you know, working together, partnering, but mostly important to me when it's come to this, the eight of pentacles is about understanding what's the need or what's the need of what you want and what's the need of other. Are we are in the same page? Are we really working together or are we work, working against each other? Well, mess and connection. Yeah, if you are in a relationship because, you know, things is good and stuff like that, you need to make it great. That's the only way that the relationship is going to survive. Because if it's not good in every level and stuff like that, you're going to have to find another way to make it great in every level. Because this is an impossible task to be in a relationship, especially if there was lesson to be have here. So that's all I'm going to say for you, my lovely Gemini. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share. Bye, Gemini.